My favorite home cooked meal, it wasn't one thing, but my dad always used to make pastas, various pastas, he's Italian. And then the next day he would make the pasta bake from the leftovers. And it was always the kind of the most crunchy thing you can imagine with a bit of cheese on top under the grill, something to die for. I would really kind of wait for the next day. I didn't finish my pasta, I'd keep it for the next day. From plenty more for someone who's not a big veggie eater, uh, I'd serve tagliatelle, which is uh, kind of pasta with walnuts and blue cheese. It's uh, not it's not a veggie focused dish, but it's it's kind of gets you there slowly, and uh, the combination of walnuts and blue cheese is one of my favorite. For my family, I cook uh, majadra, which is an Arab dish made out of lentils and rice with tons of uh, fried onion folded through. It is uh, it's a kind of a wonderful thing, but it's also, uh, you can eat it all day. You can have it for breakfast, lunch, or dinner, and it's kind of, it's good all the time, and you, can ha you can't have enough of it. In Plenty More, I actually have a recipe for a cauliflower cake, and some kids don't like vegetables. If you put the cauliflower in the cake with eggs and flour, essentially you've got bread, which kids normally like or even, even more so a savory cake, and the cauliflower is very dominant but very delicious inside. Every home cook should have a tub of Lebanese tahini paste, a jar of preserved lemon, and for spice they should help, probably have some ground cardamom, which is really nice for sweet and sour dishes. It's, uh, it's pretty special.